all right welcome back from um, the last video we basically have an app running like we did last time um, I think I was talking about some errors that they had last time which was um, it will just uh, not show these things and I think the main reason was uh, when we click on let's say now the artist but because it doesn't have the same kind of data that the playlist playlist will um, it kind of crashes the whole server but I think once we fix that, that'll be fine. So if I click on Eminem for now, that's fine, right? It'll show nothing because, of course, it doesn't have the uh, data required. But if I go into Mood now, nothing will load. And our server would have crashed. So if I go back, there you go. As you can see, the server's crashed. And I have to erase. Oh, it actually, like, completely crashed. Uh, but anyway. So we run that. And then I think once we fix that, it'll all be fine. Um, so today, as I said, we're going to continue on this idea. So now today we're going to work on when we click on top artists and top tracks. And something I want to do is to actually um, move this around a little bit. Uh, I don't need the nav bar here. I won't need the nav card, I think. Just save it anyway. So basically, um, the details page and everything else uh, I want to separate the components for the playlist, artist, and the uh, tracks. And our details page will basically show all of them just by using a conditional. So um, so in here, I'll start by creating a component called playlist details.tsx. Yeah, that'll do. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Okay, so what I just did was um, copy all of the uh, JSX in the return into playlist details. So this is what our playlist will be. And however, it will not have all of the data, right, that we need. So what it needs is the cover image. It needs the name of the item and it needs all tracks. Those are the three things. Then it will display everything properly. So um, what we will say is in here, we will uh, create an interface. It was simply called playlist tracks track in um, playlist track props. Oh. And then in here it will receive uh, three things, which is the cover image and the name. So let's just call it name. And that will be a string it will have the cover image which will also be the string and finally it will have all tracks Is that what I called it all tracks which will just be a list of um, objects but I don't know if I have to redefine each of them mm. but we'll see we'll see about that but um, so now um, in here we can say dot fc and what it will take is the playlist track props a list of that there we go and then in here uh, it'll basically take the Take the name. Um, it'll take the cover image, and it'll take all the tracks. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's in here as well. I think I, it's not cover image; it's cover image. A list of uh, playlist track props okay now because i will have the name in the cover image separately and then i will have a list of uh, all tracks because that will be for a playlist and uh, okay um so i won't have a list of playlist track props which i can make before i send it hmm Okay, so um, what I've just thought of is uh, if we go back to our details, we have the 
interface for all our tracks so we will need that we'll copy that and comment it here just in case we need it again um, so I'll replace this uh, with our track props and in here um, we won't need this right playlist detail and what I'm going to say is our name is going to be a string our cover image is also going to be a string and our all tracks is actually going to be a list of track props there you go and then I think um, that should do the job instead of saying name let's call it item name the same what we've uh, renamed at the bottom cover image is cover image and I think all tracks is still called all tracks okay so once we pass why is there a playlist details playlist details there we go so no errors for the time being in this page so what I really want to do is uh, our details will actually receive some uh, in another interface so we'll call interface um, so we'll call uh, details pay this uh, details prop and this prop uh, will need some things uh, from our app and what we will get is the actual name of the playlist which will be a string okay do we even need to pass that because we will we get that within the playlist details oh, all, all it really needs is a JSX element right, so I might not need any of that so what I'm thinking of is instead of getting all of these, ooh, uh, but I'm doing all of the use effect up here. Mm -hmm. So I need to think about how. Um, actually, in my app, I just call the details, right? I call the root with details and I call the details page and all I pass in is access token and what I will do is I'll get the access token and then I'll return the playlist details depending on the type okay so it doesn't really need anything extra um, so that's fine um, all tracks now question is do I need all tracks yes I do and does it need track props yes it does yeah. And now I'm in a bit of a pickle because now I'm just duplicating the same code twice okay I think for now we'll, we'll copy it back <laughs> in I uh, will leave it here um, but okay so what I'm saying is we will do all of this we'll fetch the data from the given uh, playlist and then we'll return a for now uh, let's just say just the playlist uh, why is this not working yes. what did I name it I thought I called it play let's keep it a capital and then here we go now it should work playlist details and playlist details what it takes is takes the name which is going to be item name I think I also named it item name there so it takes the item name it will take the cover image and that'll simply be the cover image and finally it takes in all tracks which will be our all our tracks what am I missing track prop is not assignable to type string all tracks track props <laughs> okay there is a problem let me just properly read this I got the item name cover image in our all track which takes in a list of track properties uh, is not assignable to please details cannot be used 
as a JSX component. Why not? It's not a valid JSX element. Okay, what have I done wrong up here? Um, thing is, I don't really know if this is the one I get confused about. All tracks should be, let me just give a look. See, this is something I don't really understand within uh, React and using it with TypeScript. Like when do, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, right? Doing it in this syntax, I think I need to look over it. But for now, I think we'll just go with the interface method and we will call it mm, playlist detail props. And what it will have is simply the things we've defined, which is the item name, which is simply going to be a string. Uh, we'll have the cover image. Uh, which is also going to be a string and it will have a all tracks properties uh, which is going to be the track props list right mm -hmm. does it know cannot find the name track props oh, so it doesn't know it is what it is as well um, let me check this again Mm -hmm, track oh this is just a um, spelling mistake up here that's fine um, and in here we'll say react.fc and it will receive the playlist detail props and that's fine and then in here won't need any of that and we'll just say we'll have the item name have the cover image and we'll have all tracks hopefully that will work um, seems to be doing fine so if I go back to the if I click on best of anime that's working right otherwise it wouldn't work so okay it is loading the right thing so now um, what I also want to pass um, into our details page is the so it comes in from the section right um, does the section have a clue on what the type of the data that we clicked on is because uh, the whole idea that I'm relying on is based on the idea of passing the type um, so it does remove the uh, get the data type in our props but what do we use it for? So that's when we say playlist or title, uh, that's fine. Um, so when we do the link, we go into slash props dot data type. Uh, okay. This is um, when we click on the view more button, right? Uh, oh, is it in the section? No, it's not in the section. I meant the name cards. Uh, but the name cards don't have any uh, way of tracking mm. and the name cards don't have any way of tracking what kind of data it is uh, so item name equals to single data dot name email okay so I need to figure out a way of uh, saying what kind of data type it is and then only I can uh, start working on these details I think I guess I could uh, target some of the uh, properties that our um, props is going to have so the data that we receive is going to have some properties based on what it is so looking through this right now I mean the name card um, component and we have the um, props right that have all of this um, data and let's say we have a playlist then it will have a playlist link whereas none of the other ones will have that right and similarly for the total tracks as well you could check genres um, I don't know if the artist I define genres for but uh, the genre will should either is only for the artist or is for the track so that's something we have to think about, but or at least popularity. I think that is only for uh, artists that I've defined. So 
uh, once we fi use one of those uh, the properties that only one of those uh, elements has I will generate this link dynamically um, so that is the plan so let's see if how that goes so what we'll say here is if I don't know if that qualifies as a valid um, JSX because technically I am inside the here uh, which is mapping through uh, various datas what if I bring it up here uh, no but then I oh no I would still have the single data yes that's what I will do okay so if I am up here here so I will say if my single data dot no playlist link so given my single data is not playlist link um, Mm -hmm. I'll say in here, I'll say const uh, URL. Uh, say URL to create, URL to direct, and we'll say set URL to direct. And that is simply going to be a uh -huh. what is going on oh no I know what is going on I'm just being dumb that's all it is yeah you state and there we go and what we'll say if single data dot playlist link is fine then we will set the URL to direct mm -hmm. set URL to direct to be um, this up here okay um, but of course it does not like that expression expected let me just check this so that error is now fixed and all we did was instead of having a a normal parenthesis we added curly braces to so we can uh, we want a multiple function uh, expressions and then simply all we had to do was uh, return the actual div that we wanted yeah. um, and we're setting it to that yeah. and similarly we'll keep adding up here so we'll say else if um, I need to say so if we say um, what do we want to go with popularity I think if there is popularity it is definitely an artist else if we have single data dot popularity and we'll again set this to be um, something else uh -huh. okay I think for now we'll just uh, add them as placeholders and again else if if we have something we have something else so if we have um, genres that is going to be tracks so we say single data dot genres and if we have that we set it again to be something of tracks of course we'll need to change this uh, depending on uh, the data that we get because data what we get here actually for tracks and um, the artists we won't even have to do a uh, post request so we can literally change certain things within the div up here here um, so instead of passing all of this we won't need to uh, we will just pass in the data and then that will be all we need I guess hopefully that will work but let us make sure um, at least the playlist function is still working um, what I want to do is actually instead of having this up here now um, I want the uh, what did I call it URL to direct that is what I called it right URL to direct and there we go so let's if we log in too many renders check yeah, limits the number of renders to prevent an infinite loop okay so we're causing too many renders now mm -hmm, mm -hmm. why is that happening 
Okay, so we have this error of um, doing an infinite loop, uh, but I think doing a little bit of research, I found that it usually happens because there's too many state changes um, within the map here. Um, so I think um, because we are using a use state here um, to uh, rename the variables for the URLs to direct um, is causing that. So instead, what I'm going to do is we're going to comment that and we're going to um, create a normal variable and we're, we're going to call it URL to direct. And in here, instead of setting the URL to direct, we'll just say URL to direct. And that's just going to be a normal string of the um, path that we want to go to. So direct that and hopefully that will work um what even was this oh that was for popularity and stuff i uh, just didn't want to make it okay there we go that's good um so if we say that okay, that's working and then if i go to the weekend okay i can't click on them because i've set it as an empty string now instead of having these else up here um what i'm going do is uh, uncomment these and mm -hmm. so instead of here again same thing here let um, no not let the URL to direct is just going to be that and same thing here also add an else statement I should have just done a switch case um, oh no I couldn't have done that because it's uh, testing different things else um, I just I didn't know, said URL to direct to be the empty one as before okay that is fine uh, so what we do need to change is uh, that's fine that's for a playlist this is for a popularity um, so we instead of going into details I can pass in the items name in the image link uh, but this won't be there because we won't have to fetch, fetch anything let's just say that and um, if it's genres um, same thing again we won't need the item link uh, we will need to figure out a way of actually getting the data um, we will have a look at that in a bit but let's just see if this is working for the time being um, so if I go and do that okay I got the item name and everything else that's working um, if I go in here okay, so I am getting the item oh, no actually no this is not working and I can't even click on the mockingbird home because that must be in the way I've defined it let's say M&M &M. um, in here why is there so many percent 20s um, image link I've got the image link as well mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so we'll call it artist details dot tsx artist details we have Let's see, we're taking some component. Okay, and then we'll return something up here, and that is fine. Um, let's say artist page, and if I go back into the details for now, and um, how do I? Do this artist. My track properties. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So once I go into the details from my um, that from my app, it passes me the access token. Uh, but how I wanted to do this was. Oh, I wanted to pass the type I think directly through the through the details page so if I go into the if else that I wrote 
is it in here no, it was in the name card so I wanted to pass the things through the name card okay um, so what I'm going to say details item name is blah 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 item link is that and I'll also add one more thing in here so it's say end type equals to playlist mm -hmm, mm -hmm. same thing in here and I'll say end type equals to um this one was for was this even for popularity so that I think that was artist artist and in here um, this one was finally for the track right so I'll say type equals to track okay so what I can do now is because these are all been fed into the details page here um, when I uh, I have the item name, I have the cover image and the item link. Um, what I can also have is type and it will be the exact same thing. Let's copy this instead of typing it again. And then we won't be getting the item link but we will be getting the type. So if in here it will say if type You know, we don't know what type is yet. Um, where did I set this? Type. And that is inside the use effect. So I actually have to create it up here as well. Let's call it data type. Uh, and we'll say set data type. fine and then we will just set the type and we'll just set it up here if everything's all okay um, so set data type to just be type okay, now uh, we'll just say data type uh, equals equals to a playlist I want it to return <laughs> Unreachable code. Um, oh yeah, why am I doing the return up here? Wait, that's why it's not working. Um, so yeah, if uh, if it's playlist, uh, then I'll do uh, return playlist detail with that, and I'll say else if. And data type equals 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 to um, let's add another equals up there should be exactly the same artist and then I want to return uh, I have not exported this one up here artist details so let's export that actually let's make that capital And then it was within the details. Um, we'll say return artist details. That should be imported now. Uh, what all oh, we need to pass in the data and stuff that it takes. Uh, so it takes in the name, cover, image, and popularity, right? Uh, did I fetch the data? No. I'll just make something up. Um, so we'll say name is going to be. I don't know. Ooh. <laughs> um, name cover image is going to be again some who and finally um, the data no not the data what did I name it now <laughs> is going to be uh, artist details prop Oh no, this is not gonna work. Um. <laughs> because all it really takes is the data, which is off the form. 
of a list which has name top artist is a cover image in popularity so it's a name cover image and uh, popularity and we'll just give it that and um, hopefully that works details page undefined is not a silent rule to where is this details but what happened here access token a string um, did I forget to give it the access token no well, why will this need an access token though playlist details might uh -huh. the playlist details does it need an access token no my normal details page uh, does need an access token but I'm not fetching anything for this or like at least the fetching has been done so what is the problem here see any problems I think it's just maybe it's just doing um, else mm -hmm. Sarah will that work okay there we go so it was just not passing the okay um so if i go into one of the playlists i get everything that i need if i go into the artist i'm getting an error and why is that um because i should not be getting an error at this point i should actually be getting hello world or something like that mm. let me check so okay i think we are back here into the artist page now so it is working um, so what the error was was such a minor error but something very easy to miss was um, where we create our link here uh, what I had was basically type equals to artist here so it would not recognize that because I had spaces inside it so all I had to do was just remove the spaces uh, from all of them and then that was fine I also put some of them in like um, less lines because I was getting too many like percent twenties here like I still do uh, it doesn't really make much difference to the uh, actual fetching or anything uh, it just looks weird so I thought maybe I'll simplify it a little bit <laughs> but yeah anyway so since we're actually in the artist page now all that's left is for us to go on github copy some code design the layout and uh, hope it works so let's start doing that so we're here uh, so it's not much within the artist by the looks of things so all we have to do is just copy that um, into our artist details <laughs> um, so um, now all we gotta do is um <laughs> Go in here. It says single data dot artist single data dot name genres. Um, I don't even know if I said genres, but we'll say for now single data dot genres. Uh, because I think it was from this time around. I don't think I've got the artist genres, but we'll see. Uh, so and here it says single data dot popularity. And then um, we don't know what single data is yet, so we'll just map over the data that we have. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Um, I don't have the genres. Uh, I'll have a look over that later. Let's just check if this is going to work first. Um, where is this coming from? Error.html. That's fine. Um, the data that we define is not going to meet the expectations, is it? 
because I've defined it as list within the details with, and, and it's not going to be a list anymore because we decided it was only going to be one item um, however I think it should be a double let's see everything that we can okay so that's working well I guess I didn't write the cover image um so if I go into artist details um within here where's my image here we would just say that dot cover image like that mm -hmm. oh yeah of course it's not going to show because we're not actually passing the real data in so um, from our details page what we got is we have all we get is the access token uh, so I might actually have to fetch uh, but I'll actually see um, what I can do here let me just have a look within the app that I can change to make sure we don't have to refetch the data I don't know what I was just thinking just then um, I don't know why I even need consider fetching because we have all the data we need right here <laughs> up here right so all I have to do is simply just be like name is item name and um, I don't need two of these actually oh no I do need two of these I don't need these I need yep name is item name um, our cover image is going to be cover image and our popularity is going to I don't think maybe I've not done that one allow that for now anyway to just check if the name and the image work and uh, that's all that really matters to us we can nope it is not working uh, why is that const item name um, item name cover image okay it has to be something with how I'm writing it here um, and it doesn't like that if I do that uh, if I put that inside a bracket and I say name um, do you do need that because since it takes the props can I not well let me go have a look at playlist details just for a second um, so playlist detail takes in um, each of the things separately whereas I was trying to do it at once um, which should be possible it's not like it can't be done uh, let me just check if I can just do it now um, it's the same kind of idea so so I don't actually think there's any issues with this um, we're not actually getting the name or anything and I think the reason is because we are checking for item link and on a playlist there won't be any item links so what I want to do is simply just remove that uh, and then we will still um, have that just to ensure everything is working properly so we will say if that then we just set it set the oh, we we're not setting anything for it as well so I don't really know why we uh, even needed it but then we fetch the data yeah then that's actually better um, as well so it will only fetch the data when we have the link otherwise it's fine so it's the sets the name and the cover image um, 
and for the popularity I just need to create something right now um, so I will say so what do I actually pass the popularity through do I pass it through the did I pass it through the um, length or so for popularity I only pass the okay so why don't I just pass it through here um, that's a much more better way of doing this than I know it might not be the best way to be honest but it'll do the job up here and it's not sensitive data so it doesn't really matter so it's a single data dot popularity that's fine now we go back in here and we say const and we'll say artist popularity and we'll say set artist popularity and that's just going to be empty mm -hmm, mm -hmm. same thing here and so type will say popularity set uh, artist popular I know set artist popularity is to be popularity okay and then <laughs> so if I go in here we will just pass in the um, artist popularity right popularity 90% Mike Bosnian popularity 70% 94 okay I just need to remove this link because I think I added that just as a debugging method mm, so that should be in artist details and if I am correct it should be here okay um genres I I can't remember if I put genres as one of the things um, for the artist I could do right now if even if there isn't one but I think I will allow it uh, let me just find the server anyway if it's already there then I'll add the okay it is there genres and popularity right so as promised because it is there I will need to get the popularity as well uh, genres I mean uh -huh. I think I want to call it artist popularity but this isn't that what I yeah that's what I call it up there so I can't let's call it popu 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 popularity why is that not liking it did I just misspell it or something there we go oh yeah, it's not liking it because it's there it's the genres that I wanted um, get it from genres mm -hmm. and we set uh -huh. artist genre to be genres and um, up here mm -hmm. genres and we'll set artist genres and a um, couple of more other things to do um, genre popularity and genres is going to be um, artist genres and if I go into artist details uh, first thing it should do in, is in here it should have a genres which is going to be a string 
and finally um, there's something I have missed which is to pass it through when I click on it so if I go on the name card type an artist let's add it here and I'll say genres equals to um, single data dot genres okay if I go back there you go that's the is genres Canadian and contemporary yep that seems correct it's fine um, I think we can make it look a bit visually appealing I think the bold actually makes it look worse so remove the bold and um, if I add it inside some square brackets okay maybe not <laughs> how can I make it look a little bit nicer um, I want letter spacing letter spacing and I don't really know what it takes pixels I think that does look a bit better to be honest um, that's fine and lastly this and um, it's not clickable and I think the only reason for that is because I am not setting it to be so if I go into details mm -hmm, it should be name card if single data has genres okay um, for my track what I actually pass through for my track is um, if I go into my server it's not is it top tracks yeah it's top tracks uh, literally all I pass is the <laughs> ID item name and name um, I could add some audio features in here because we will be using that um, maybe I should work on both of them at the same time how about that because I do have get audio features and if I can somehow get the audio features um, have the audio features and have the required features and it returns the required features um, if I send that back uh, in here so what does it take again uh, it takes in the audio features and the song ID right and what does my get top tracks need <laughs> I think I can do it through here um, so when I whenever I do a get top tracks um, I can I'll say const um, ID right um, so I'll say track ID no why am I that's just getting top tracks um, it's not this has nothing to do with a single track uh, so oh I guess I'll just have to uh, do an else for the time being um, so what I'll say is um, where is it name card uh, and in here I'll copy this I'll put that there Uh, so it'll pass in the details uh, it'll pass the name and it'll pass the image link and type will be set as a track yeah oh yeah yeah so um, let me go else here right now and then and that else in here comment that out for now see if that works okay so I am getting an error how am I getting an error when the error isn't even defined oh no it's not from here though it says the error is from 
our details page instead of returning that list copy that um, which will be very similar and we won't be returning artist details instead we will return the track details uh -huh. and it will have the name cover image uh, and that's it it has something else didn't it or did it not no it just has the name in the cover image but of course this page will have to show much more than just the name in the cover image um, which we will work through one by one because I will need to do a fetch for this mm, so in components we'll say track details const track details and we'll do the react dot fc and I'll set track props and that's going to take some data and we'll return something track details and of course track props is not defined so we'll say const no not const um, we'll just say track prop props there have a name and you'll have a cover image I actually want to keep this smaller because uh, just to keep consistency with how I've written everything else up to this point um, so that looks fine and you'll just have some data that was fine do I have to say data is going to be tried mm, you say Keep forgetting this syntax every time and then okay um, now we can just return the um, details track details but however I think there is a lot going on there right now if I go on github what the track details looking like let's see okay so I've set all of the um, styling in place um, so what is this artist name um, I haven't sent that so allow this for now will something we will work over time uh, let's have a look so we're here click on one and there we go so we got the image and the title here and that is all we have defined and I think that is it for video um, this video we are approaching towards the end of this project so everything's looking good so all we really have to do is get the charts going up here the charts that we needed uh, for our uh, the audio features of any song um, and we will also have to make sure like all of this charts and everything plugin also uh, work from here so right now they are not clickable uh, so when I click on this song it should direct us to the same details page uh, that we have here um, and I think that is it uh, for artists I don't think there is anything extra that we need to add I think that is all we had defined previously and if I go back yeah I guess this is cool <laughs>